a story of Britain, but Britain as we very rarely see her, from above. This one power station can supply 7% of the nation's electricity, enough to power over 6 million homes. Except there aren't 6 million homes anywhere near here. Drax's electricity is carried the length and breadth of the country on a maze of high-tension power cables. It's aerial linesman Adam Crick's job to keep them running. There's a huge amount of power lines. It's like a spider's web of power lines. Um, the lines are turning left and right. Um, and, and you're looking at the conductors all the while as they're coming past you um, while the aircraft is moving, doing somersaults. It's like a roller coaster ride. If I admit, I had to use the sick bag a number of times. But you get used to it. It pays the bills. Adam's job can only be done from the air. His helicopter is equipped with a thermal imaging camera mounted underneath its nose. While the pilot flies the helicopter up front, Adam sits in the back, using the camera to search out hot spots. These are areas of unusually high temperature which show up white on his screen, and they're the signs of a failing connection. If the power line wasn't maintained and hot spots were left to their own accord, then um, with the amount of load going through them, which is high, especially this time of the year in the winter, then they would fail, they would melt. Today, Adam and his pilot are on an inspection run over some low-level power lines, and they're working just feet off the ground. Just panning the camera. OK, we've got some hot spots here, actually, on the 33 kV in front. OK, there's multiple hot spots on this next... Is that birds on the line, or...? No, this is a hot spot on this one here. So if you take us in as close as you can, and I think we probably want to go to the right just very slightly, mining for the trees. This is Adam's most dangerous type of work. He's at tree height, right next to a cable carrying 33,000 volts. OK, tell me when you're happy and take us as close as you can, please. OK, just getting that in focus now taking some pictures. Once Adam and his pilot have discovered a hot spot like this, he calls in a repair team, and if the fault is severe enough, they can be on site in less than an hour. Not bad. Have you tried to call an electrician recently? It takes Adam six months to check his bit of the national grid, and when he's finished, he has to go back to the beginning and start all over again. <laughs> 